Hello, welcome back to the Happy Huts. I'm Neil Mossy and thanks for clicking on this video because I, I think I know why you're here. I recently hit 1000 subscribers on YouTube and I'm still reeling because I wasn't quite expecting it. It did happen quite quickly after two years of, of waiting. I suddenly got a surge of subscribers and then went through that hallowed 1K mark. When I hit a thousand subscribers, I just have one question. I looked up lots of videos like this because I wanted to know what happens when you hit the 1000 subscribers? How long does it take to become monetized? What messages do you get from YouTube? I just didn't know anything about it. I was also a bit worried that I wouldn't actually get monetized after a thousand subscribers. So I'm gonna walk you through all of the steps. You and me are gonna get through this as swiftly as possible, but I know that it's gonna be a long video because I'm gonna show you just as many screenshots and screen grabs and screen recordings as possible. You will actually see my analytics, my studio dashboard, and I'm gonna show you all the money that, that came in in that first month and second month, just so you get an idea of financially what happens. I'm gonna show you my AdSense and I'm going to be making a few of these videos as well. If you need any more details, have a look in the description because there might be one or two other videos on what happens when you hit 1000 subscribers coming up. It was on the 10th of March this year. I hit the big 1000. I've got a screen grab here. You can see it's at 3.38 in the afternoon UK time. It felt great. I finally done it. So let's take a look at what was going on in, in my studio dashboard at the time. As you can see, I had uh, 1008 subscribers. Suddenly these tabs in studio that did not work before but suddenly unlocks these treasures. When you click on monetization, it actually opens up the application. I was demonetized in 2018. So step one and step two had already been completed. That was a big relief because I didn't really want to go through setting up the link to, to AdSense again. My first tip and piece of advice, I would sign up for Google AdSense ASAP. You can sign up to AdSense right now and make sure that Google AdSense has all of your details. There are lots of good tutorial videos on how to uh, get the AdSense, but get the AdSense account ready now so that like me, when you hit the 1000 subscriber mark, it's, it's just good to go. So the only step that was left for me was this step three here, get reviewed. YouTube will review your channel to make sure that it complies with the YouTube monetization policies. <laughs> Suddenly this voice in my head is saying, what if the monetization isn't approved? I've spent two years begging viewers on a video by video basis to subscribe. What if all that work was for nothing? And then uh, you can see this at the, at the top of the screen at 23.35, so just 25 minutes <laughs> before midnight that same day, I got this really regular notification. Congrats, your channel just hit its first 1000 subscribers. <laughs> this is a big moment. And when this happens to you, congratulations from, from all of us who have done this before, well done. But I thought I'd get more than just a thing in my notifications feed. They haven't even drawn the icon properly, <laughs> look at it. Anyway, I'll take it, I'll take it. I hit the 1000 mark there. On the 14th of March, this happened. At the top of my studio page, you know where they put the warning messages and the, the alerts? I just saw this by chance. I could have missed it so easily. It said, congratulations. You have been accepted into the YouTube Partner Program. Have some sound effects. You can now monetize your videos and access support. Yes. That is how I found out. It's just a, a message on the screen. Would it kill you to, to send a nice email or <laughs> they would do some kind of animation or something? I don't think YouTube realizes how big a deal this is for a creator to hit. 1,000 subscribers. I did actually get an email much later. Neil Mossy, we always knew that this day would come and we hoped that you did too. You're doing amazing work and we couldn't be happier for you. Now go and share this GIF and the good news using the hashtag 1KCreator. My YouTube life had changed. I was monetized again. So now you're thinking, that's great, but how much money did you get for that first day? Let's take a, another look at the analytics. This is the first month right here. 
Welcome to my channel analytics. You can see that in March in total, I had 109,000 views. The watch time in March alone was 5.5 thousand views. My subscribers had gone up by 300. And this was my estimated revenue. Now what I'll do is I'll show you my AdSense to see exactly how much money that equates to. On the first day, I got 14 cents. <laughs> I found out, I think in the afternoon, so this is not even half a day's worth of money. And also I hadn't clicked monetize on the videos in my studio, in the dashboard. So that's another tip for you. Monetize, you have to go into the video to turn on monetization for your videos. I had about 300 videos. I could not get them monetized quick enough <laughs> going into each and every video, ticking those boxes. The next day was a bit more healthy and I think it's probably my best day ever, but I got $7.27 for one day and if I can show you the views for that one day I had 12,000 views and that brought in seven dollars 27 cents and if you're watching this anywhere else in the world there is a way to get studio to show estimated revenue in your local currency so if you follow my cursor down to the left hand side go all the way down to the bottom there see where it says settings click on settings and the very first option is to change currency and if you click the pull down menu look look at all of these different currencies there we go the british pound so when i hit save you can see $56 equates to about £47. When I hit the 1000 subscriber mark, there were two toys being able to stream live from my phone or a mobile device and access to the community tab. Let's deal with the first one, streaming live from your mobile, from your cell phone. So you can see here, this is what would happen. You click on the, the camera icon at the top of your YouTube app and you have two options, record or go live. When you click on the go live button, this error message comes up. Eligibility, your channel does not meet our updated eligibility requirements basically you haven't got a thousand subscribers for mobile live streaming you can still stream with your webcam or broadcasting software yeah but i want to do it from my phone <laughs> so the big question was now i had hit a thousand subscribers would i be able to stream from my phone and the great news for me was yes you can so when you you click on that camera button after 1000 subscribers you get the go live option and that opens up all of the menus and it's all fairly self-explanatory of course I've not I've not done it in the three months since I've become monetized, but it's good to have, right? The other big toy that I wanted with 1000 subscribers is the community tab. I got this email on the, you can see it here, on the 19th of March. So that's about a week and a half later. Neil Mossy, welcome to your YouTube community tab. Get even closer to your audience. Now you're okay. <laughs> Poll your viewers, share pictures and more with new community posts. I was really excited when the community tab arrived arrived because uh, finally I in my head I could be like my favorite massive youtubers and spray out some community posts I don't think gut instinct I get any form of google juice or seo I don't think I get increased views from posting on the community tab I, it feels really pointless right now but anyway so you get you get the ability to put posts out Oh, and the other toy that you get, which I wasn't really expecting, is access to Creator Academy. This is what YouTube Creator Academy looks like. You can see the tabs at the top here are My Academy, Catalog. So lots of lessons in here, learning toolkits. So basics of going live, monetization, pivoting your content. I might have a look at that because I feel like my channel is a bit of a mishmash of different things. Uh, community engagement and production. And then there are some creator resources that opens up a new tab. So these are, are blog posts and uh, links to the YouTube creators workshops. If any of this has been any use, please, could you could you hit the subscribe button just to help me on my way to 10,000 subscribers and I can make a video for you all about what that's like. <laughs> 1,000 isn't enough. Two years it took me to get to this point. Oh, it feels like another mountain to get to the 10K subs. I got an email on the 23rd of April. So you have to wait a full calendar month before you get the email that tells you that you have some money.
for the first time as a monetized YouTuber. This is the email that comes in from Google AdSense. Check your recent payments. We sent a payment for your Google AdSense earnings on the 23rd of April 2020. If I dive back into my analytics on YouTube Studio, the estimated revenue is $56.77 for my, my first month. If I click on the revenue tab, let me give you a walk through my first month. As you can see, it says 26,000 monetized playbacks. So I had 109,000 views, but only 26,000 monetized playbacks. Now I'm slightly confused here because I had seen on more than a few videos where uh, creators were explaining that you only get half of this money that's quoted and I don't think that's correct. If I translate this into pounds, see, so we can compare it with the actual payments, the revenue in pounds is 47 pounds and 4p. Let's take a look at my Google AdSense. My earnings on YouTube came out at 45 pounds 84 pence. So if I compare that with the analytics estimate, that's really close, isn't it? Look, 47 pounds 4p and I actually got 45 pounds 84. I can show that with my second month. So this is my next full month of money from being monetized. My estimated revenue is 91 pounds 64. If I go over to Google AdSense, there we go, 91 pounds 62 pence. So I'll flip back, it's 91 pounds 64 was the estimate. The actual payment was £91.62. So if you are wondering, do you actually get all the money quoted in the channel analytics, your estimated revenue is pretty much the actual cash that you will receive from Google AdSense. And just for completion, the third month, May, was a very good month. <laughs> I had 58,000 monetized playbacks and that equaled £154.74. So I don't know if this is too crude, but it looks like roughly I get £3 for every thousand monetized playbacks. And quickly, so you can make the comparison in US dollars for 58,000 monetized playbacks, I got $190, but bear in mind that I'm in the UK and I think because I have quite a large proportion of views coming from the UK, I think that brings down my revenue per thousand views. I'm gonna make another video where I go into all the detail about how much money I made for the first three months. That link will be in the description below. If you hit the subscribe button, you will be notified. We're all in this together. <laughs> so thank you so much for being there. If you have any questions at all, leave a comment because if I can't answer it, I'm sure other people in the community would love to help. And it's always great to hear from you. It's my personal mission to help as many people as possible to express themselves on YouTube and through podcasts and eBooks. I've put everything into one playlist, Make Your Stuff Now. That link is over there. It's at the top of the screen and is also in the description. If you're feeling even kinder, why not hit the thumbs up button to help other people to find this video. And thanks again for subscribing. I'll see you at 10,000 subscribers. Yes, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Can you please help my daddy get 10,000 subscribers? Just click on his face. Thanks, bye. All right, this is gonna be the proper one, Mike.